Hi everyone, this is Dave from Geekanoids and welcome to my unboxing and first look at a new action camera. You all know that I love my GoPro. This is an alternative to the GoPro and it looks really good indeed. This is the Liquid Image Ego Extreme Sports Cam and this is a Wi-Fi action camera, so it's Wi-Fi capable. We're going to unbox this in this video along with some accessories just here. And in fact, I'm going to make you wait to see the uh, little Ego action camera and just pop that off to one side. I just want to show you the accessories they sent through as well. This here is a suction mount. I'm going to unbox this so that you, uh, or unpack it so that you get to have a look at it. It's not going to be easy to get into though by the looks of things. So we're going to have to cut through the, oh no, here we go. We can get in on the side here. There we go. So this is the suction mount. I just want to show you these accessories first and save the best bit till last. So here we go. It's uh, got a normal standard sort of tripod mount. So if you bought this uh, accessory for your Ego camera, this could actually be used for a little compact camera as well. So it's fully adjustable. We've got a little sort of ball mount mechanism here so you can adjust the angle of this and what looks like a nice sort of, sort of solid suction mount as well. So nice that they gave me that to test. We just pop that off to one side. And these are additional purchases. Then we've got the uh, Extreme Sports Cam. This is, I think, a low profile flat mount. So sticky mount on this side. And then again, we've got the standard sort of tripod mount on here. Let's just open this one up. Not very easy to get into, these accessories. Tut tut. I don't like packaging like this. So let's just get my little knife and we will cut through this one. Hope I don't slice my fingers. Urgh, there we go. So this one here, they're calling their low profile flat mount. You can just shake this out. There we go. So we've got these sort of 3M sort of sticky pads. This is a spare one. And then we've got one already applied to the mount. And this just sticks maybe on a helmet, or maybe you're using it on a boat or a surfboard or your skis and you just stick this on. A uh, nice sort of uh, very, very sticky these are, these 3M sticky pads, I've used these before. And then you've got the same standard tripod sort of mount. So you could use this with an action cam or again with your compact camera. So another useful accessory that I will be using during my testing. And then the last one, I'm gonna do this nice and quickly because I know you're all waiting to see the actual action camera itself. And this is a bike mount. Again, standard sort of threaded mount on the top here. Adjustable, thanks to that ball joint. And then this can just clamp onto your handlebars. So three additional useful mounts. And then we move on to the camera itself. So let's have a little look around the packaging. You can see here 12 megapixel sensor, full 1080 HD video. Also the Wi-Fi capability. So there is an app that you can use with this. Works with iPhone and Android. Round on the back, it looks like we've got a little housing in here. And then round on the side, just some more details of what you might use it for. So we've got a little seal to undo on the bottom. So we're just gonna cut through that. And we've also got some tape on the side. So it looks like they want you to peel this tape off. And also you can see their website address there, liquidimageco.com. So do check them out. And you can get these in all different colors. So we're going to peel this off all the way around. And yes, I do not jump out of aeroplanes, but these action cams come in very, very handy for placing at different angles. That's really nice packaging as well, actually. We've got all the accessories in the bottom and then in this top section, hoping this just comes out like so, which it does, we have got the camera itself. So we'll come onto the camera in a short while. Let's just pop that off to the side, see what else we're getting in here. So we have got micro USB to full size USB cable. We've got some extra 3M mounts there and a really big mount, sort of another flat mount, but a lot bigger, which you can obviously slide the camera in and out of. So that's really nice. Then we've got loads and loads of user manuals in different languages 
and some warranty information. Pop that back in there. And then this section here, what's this? Is this something we can use? This looks like a little sort of front cover. So not a full case, it just looks like a clip-on cover to go on the front of the actual camera to give it some extra protection. So that's really nice. So instead of a fully enclosed case, we've got this. I'm pretty sure, and don't quote me on this, I will let you know this when I do further coverage on here, uh, but pretty sure that it, being an action camera is sort of weatherproof as well. So no need for a, perhaps a, a full enclosure to make this weatherproof. And then this is the little camera itself. Let's see how we get this out. So we've got some little ties underneath to undo. There we go, that's them undone. Like so. And then we should be able to just slide this off, which we can. So it's got sort of a similar mounting mechanism to the GoPro range in the fact that this can remain on the camera and then you can clip this on and off of various mounts. So that's really nice. And then if we unscrew this, you will see that all those other mounts, they've got the standard tripod sort of thread on it. We have got a standard tripod thread on the bottom of the camera. So very, very easy to interchange with other things and even use if you want to on a regular tripod. So let's have a look around the camera. So we've also got the lens on the front, little pinhole mic, uh, lick, liquid image something. I think it was liquid image co, isn't it? So, so this is their sort of a logo. Really, really nice. Some sort of uh, light on the front perhaps or focus assist. And then on the top here, we've got a little screen. So this is gonna give us some feedback as to what mode it's in. We've got a button here, which is probably gonna be used for stopping and starting recording. We've also got another button here for the menu and powering on and off. And then underneath this little cover here, we have got a memory card. So they include a memory card in the package. So an eight gigabyte SanDisk Ultra memory card, micro SD. And then we've got an AV out port and also the uh, micro USB. Little reset button in here as well. So really nice underneath this flap. I'm assuming once this flaps on, that sort of weatherproofs it. We've got a little lanyard connection and the rest of it is completely clear. So let's just turn this on, see if it has got any power, which it has. And you can just about see the little tiny display in there. And it's set to 720p at the moment. There's a little battery meter. And it also shows you that there is a memory card in there as well. Quite hard to see that. So I'm going to be interested to see how the menu works. And more importantly, what the video quality is like. This is obviously an LED to give you some sort of feedback as to what mode we're in. So a really nice little camera. This is the Liquid Image Ego Full HD Action Cam. Please do subscribe to the channel so you can see some footage from this and I'll let you know how it performs in a future video. Thanks very much for watching. I'll see you all next time.